Lee's nine-year anniversary celebration continues with a drunch match! Absolutely, without a doubt. Now you're going to hear this crowd get into it here. One of the crowd favorites here in HOG. David Adams. David Adams almost got <laughs> taken out. Montekia got blasted with a German suplex. Well, you know, I was going to ask you, JD. I was going to say, are we going to see the same Montekia tonight? But are we going to see? I don't. I haven't seen this side of suicide before. I, I, I don't know what is up with suicide, Jason. I was going to ask you my theory behind all of this, and please chime in if you have a better explanation. But my theory is that suicide, since Montekia as a force. As our Luchador up and over. Monta trying to fight out of this. Off the ropes. You expected this. You expected this from both of these guys. Undrag takedown by Monte. Monte with another arm drag. Suicide reeling. Test of strength here. Big overhand chop. Monte off the ropes, flying through the skies with that wrist lock takeover. Look out. Back elbow by Suicide misses. <laughs> there you go. Suicide wants no part of that. There you go. Like I said, he's our superhero. Now, the word going around nowadays in pro wrestling is superhero. I, I won't get into that. But Monte is our superhero, but Suicide here is here, Jason, to take that superhero spot from Montekia. That's got to be the reason, right? I, I mean, I, I can't come up with a better explanation. I mean, my question would be, why now? Crossbody off the top. Monte almost got the job done right then and there. Why now? That's what I want to know. I mean, Montekia has been a mainstay here in House of Glory. There has to be something that set this guy up. I'm not about to go ask him either. I mean, you're more than I welcome. Don't, I don't want to ask him. You can go talk to him if you want to. I don't want to ask him. Monte's superhero status is now. Oh, 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 oh. Uh -oh. Put the brakes on quick there. Almost lost our ring announcer. Now we almost lost a ref. Well, look at that. Double foot stomp down to the mat. Suicide. Very intense cover there by Suicide. Suicide seems angry. He seems like a man possessed. Angry. Oh, my God. Jeez. Montekia has never had his superhero status tested here in House of Glory. Well, he may have met his match in suicide. Choking Monte out with that foot on the bottom rope. Working that referee's four count. Getting in the referee's face now. You can't put your hands on a referee like that. This outlaw bandit that just come into House of Glory. Super kick by Monte. Monte Whoa. reeling there. You can see you can see the offense and what it's done to, to Montekia already. Oh my god, wow. look at that looking for that blockbuster wow. off the top. Suicide caught him in a vertical suplex down with an X-Plex. Holy cow! I have never seen Montekia thrown around like this before. Crowd loved that. 
look at that suicide with a very lazy look. It's not going to beat the former champion. He threw him like a sack of garbage. I, I, I mean, have you ever seen Montague get thrown around like not this really, before? No. I can't say that I have. Well, Monte's been up and down as of late. But Montague right now is really from this offensive attack from suicide. Those hand gestures, Jason, those, those hand gestures look like he's really here to take Montekia out once and for all. On the ropes. Tranquilo by suicide. Shoulder check right into the midsection. Monte springboard, Karana. Suicide rolls to the outside. Monte quick as a cat. Suicide dives for the ropes. No oh, Monte can't pull the ropes. I'm sorry. Suicide is the barricade. He may be going for another. Springboard cross body by Monte. Right in front of the House of Glory faithful. Monte and throws him right to the steel. This match certainly looks like it's going to be taken up a notch here. To me, that's what makes suicide even that much more intimidating. You don't know what motivates the guy. No. Why is he here? Why does he hate Monte so much? The fact that we don't know is what makes him so scary. His objectives may be the Crown Jewel Championship. Who the hell knows? Maybe he wanted to take Montaki out first, be the only superhero in House of Glory, go after TJP, and win it all. I don't know. Look at that strength. Look at that strength. Drives him down. Cover. Wow. That, was that is two and three fourth sticks of butter, Jason. That was razor close, is what that was. That could have gone either way, and Suicide is not happy. He thought that was three. I think I think he might be right. Oh, he's calling for the finish. He is going to end Monte. He mentioned those hand gestures. There it is again. That's several times he's done that. And doing that to Monte is not going to help his cause. No, not at all. Uh -oh. Monte grabs Suicide's hands. Locks that right hand, right hand of his own, again. Ducks that clothesline, does Monte, another one. Big flying forearm, another one. Monte is suicide reeling. Keeping up on this offensive attack here, over and over, sunset flip, suicide rolls through. Look at the power of suicide. He muscled him up. Electric chair, poison runner by Monte. Cover, hooks the leg, two. Wow, wow. Monte, up top. Looking to finish suicide here. Jason, that momentary hesitation might have cost Monte there. It might have cost him the win. I'm very impressed by, by suicide. Most men in the ring with Monte taking that kind of offense, he would have finished him off. Absolutely. But not suicide. We've certainly seen a different Monte here tonight. His offense is just as explosive as ever. As motivated as I have ever seen him. And why not? I mean, look what happened. Look what's happened to him. He lost his championship. I would be motivated, too. This might be a mistake, though, giving a man like Suicide with his unknown intentions all this time to recover. Takes him out. Look at that. Well, you were saying. Monte was looking for that big overhand right. Wow, look at that. Unique move there by Suicide. Plants Monte face first. Now Suicide setting him up. Wow. A sunset bomb into the turnbuckle. That might be it. Wow. I don't. 
don't believe it. I don't believe Monte that was still a, has that fighting spirit. That Jason. was a kick out on instinct there. That's the only way that happened. Monte doesn't know where he is right now. He kicked out on pure instinct. You see that frustration on suicide right there, slamming the mat. He doesn't know what he has to do to defeat Monte. Well, he wanted the full Monte. He's getting the full Monte. He is, indeed. He's slapping him around. Look at this. Both men going at it here. Wow! Wow! wow. There's that stunner by Monte. Suicide is reeling. How he's up on his feet, I don't know, but Monte's up top. He's wobbly. As that block busted into the stunner, knocks the referee out. Oh, no. We got a man down. Oh, no. And he's going for the cover. Monte's going for the cover. But there's no referee. You can count to 20. It doesn't matter. There's no referee. What is going on here? Oh, what an unfortunate turn of events here for Monte. Monte now looking at the referee, finally realizing what's going on. Trying to wake the ref. Suicide now in the corner. Monte has to keep a close eye on Suicide. Exploding out of the corner with that big boot. Look at that. has been on a suicide mission, you might say. And he has done the impossible. And now poor Montekia, through no fault of his own, the referee was knocked down. I think he may have had the match won. What does this do to Montekia? The better question is, where does suicide go from here? It may be mission accomplished. He may have fulfilled his prophecy. He may be looking for that Crown Jewel Championship next. I have no idea. But montekia has got to be heartbroken after what happened here tonight. Well, you know, you got to ask the question, is this... Look at this guy. Is this a streak? I mean, now Monte, he's on a bad streak now going into the new year. What does that do to his motivation? What does that do to his, his whole outlook going forward? Monte pleading with the referee. He's got, his heart has to be broken. Either way, look at it, folks. Suicide beats the buttery luchador here at Hog 9. Who knows what's next for Monte Kia in 2020? We'll keep a close eye on this developing situation. More to come at Hog 9.